we have to integrate cosec to the power 6x dx. We can write this cosec to the power 6x as the product of cosec to the power 4x into cosec square x into dx. And this is equal to cosec to the power 4x into we can write this cosec square x as 1 plus cot square x into dx. So this is equal to cosec to the power 4x dx plus integration cot square x into cosec to the power 4x. After multiplying cosec to the 4x with the element of the bracket, we get this. Now, this cosec to the 4x can be written as the product of cosec square x and cosec square x dx and this cot square x and this cosec to the 4x can also be written as cosec square x into cosec square x into dx now this cosec square x can be written as 1 plus cot square x And this cosec square x can also be written as 1 plus cot square x into dx. Now, multiply this cosec square x with the elements of the bracket. So it will be cosec square x dx plus integration of cosec square cot square x into cosec square x dx. Plus now we consider that cot x is equal to z so the derivative of cot x that is minus cos x square x dx is equal to dz ok now we have to put this condition on our integration so it will be this is minus dz because cos x square x dx is minus dz there and cot square x is z square into this is minus dz plus this is z square this is also minus dz and this is z to the power 4 into t minus dz now this is equal to integration of minus dz is minus z plus integration of minus z square is minus z cube by 3 and integration of this is also minus z cube by 3 and integration of z to the power 4 minus is minus z to the power 5 by 5 plus a constant c now we have to put the value of z that is cot x So it would be cot x minus one third cot cube x minus one third cot cube x minus one fifth cot to the power five x plus constant c. Now we can add this, and this is equal to minus cot x minus two by three cot cube x plus one fifth 
minus one fifth cot to the five x plus the constant c. Thus, we can integrate cosec to the power six x in this process.